artificial intelligence discovers alternative physics. A team of researchers from Columbia University has developed an artificial intelligence program that observes physical events and identifies pertinent variables, which is a necessary first step in physics theory development. However, the variables it identified were unexpected. The researchers began by feeding the network video of a swinging double pendulum with two arms whose angular velocity and angle values were known. After hours of processing, the AI gave a result, but now the researchers had to figure out what variables the program had identified. Because the program can't provide human-readable descriptions of the variables, extraction was challenging. Two variables appeared to correspond to arm angles, whereas the other two were still obscure. They believed the AI had discovered a valid set of four variables based on its accurate predictions, but they still couldn't understand what mathematical language it was using. Once the researchers validated the known answers of a variety of other physical systems, they then fed the network videos of systems for which they did not know the explicit answer. One of these videos depicted an air dancer dancing in front of a car parking lot. After several hours of analysis, the program returned eight variables. A lava lamp was also recorded, resulting in eight variables. When they supplied a video of flames from a holiday fire, the program returned 24 variables. A question the researchers had was whether the set of variables was unique for every system. In the experiments, the number of variables was the same each time the AI restarted, but the variables themselves were different each time. According to the results, it appears that there are various ways to describe the universe, and physics may not be as comprehensive as it is currently perceived. This AI could theoretically help researchers discover complex phenomena in areas ranging from cosmology to biology. The work done with this AI model serves as a precursor for the potential development of yet undiscovered physics theories and principles that could end up being the basis for other breakthrough technologies. NVIDIA AI unveils its latest NEMO Megatron Large Language Model Framework. Artificial intelligence has a continuous use case for natural language processing early in its life, such as customer service chatbots and voice-controlled assistants found with Amazon's Alexa or Apple's Siri. Other devices that rely on natural language processing are the autocorrect function on smartphones. This wide range of applications is driving a global NLP market which Fortune Business Insights predicts will increase from $20.98 billion last year to a value of $127.26 billion by 2028. Last year, NVIDIA released its Nemo Megatron, which is a Triton inference server-based large language model framework. This week, the company has released an optimization and scaling tool for large language model training on as many GPU as desired, which it says will considerably speed up the training process. It will achieve this using two new methods, which are sequence parallelism and selective activation recomputation. According to NVIDIA, its latest NEMO Megatron updates will enable 30% faster training times for models ranging from 22 billion to 1 trillion parameters in size. Models with 175 billion parameters can also be trained using 1024 NVIDIA A100 GPU in just 24 days, which is a reduction of 10 days or about 250,000 hours of GPU computing. For researchers training large language models, this affects what can be trained and how long that training will take. Researchers can get early access to NVIDIA's Nemo Megatron, while enterprises also can try it on NVIDIA's Launchpad, which provides them with short-term access to hardware and software stacks in areas such as AI, simulations, and data science. Previously, NVIDIA used tensor parallelism to distribute the workload for large matrix multiplications, but now there are some residual layers. In the past, people replicated the computation of those layers on every GPU because they required less compute relative to the larger matrix values. Once a system is big enough, these leftover layers consume a larger proportion of compute. With sequence parallelism, NVIDIA engineers are using data mapping between GPU to parallelize that work. Now scientists training large language models can split that between multiple GPU, meaning they don't need to repeatedly compute or store all of the intermediate memory for the loose layers on each GPU. Selective activation recomputation comes in handy in a different situation though. 
Researchers discovered that when a model becomes so large that it can fit into the training system, a live intermediate state for each of the layers can be stored inside the transformer blocks. If there was no other way to fit the model, then an approach like this made sense, meaning that they were either recomputing everything or nothing. NVIDIA engineers realized that different activations need different numbers of operations for recomputation. Because of this, they disproportionately use more storage but only a small percentage of the compute. Memory requirements can be reduced by five times by using sequence activation recomputation and sequence parallelism. The new hyperparameter tool can automatically figure out the correct configurations for training and inference without needing to change any code. The tool utilizes an empirical grid search and heuristics to determine configurations that offer the best sequence, tensor, data, and pipeline parallelism, as well as the optimal micro-batch size and number of activation checkpointing layers. According to Google DeepMind, they have successfully predicted the structure of nearly every protein known to science, which was one of the field's grand challenges to pave the way for new discoveries and technologies in areas such as healthcare, food security, and climate change research. DeepMind's AlphaFold program has made available a database of more than 200 million protein structures to the public. In a news conference, DeepMind CEO Demis Hassabis referred to the database as the entire protein universe, encompassing every organism's sequenced genome. Scientists have long been interested in understanding how protein chains are intricately twisted and folded into three-dimensional shapes to bring about life. Because of the importance of structure to function, Researchers have sought to unravel this process. For example, knowing the structure of a protein and how it interacts with its various molecules may help researchers identify suitable targets for therapeutic treatment. DeepMind says that AlphaFold's enhanced database includes proteins for plants, bacteria, animals, and other organisms. Researchers can utilize AlphaFold's updates to further their work on major issues such as environmental sustainability, neglected diseases, and food insecurity. DeepMind demonstrated that AI could accurately predict the protein shapes at scale with atomic accuracy in the span of just minutes. With this, AlphaFold has not only solved the 50-year grand challenge, but it also proved that artificial intelligence can dramatically accelerate scientific discovery while advancing humanity. Determining the conformation is not an easy process and usually relies on advanced techniques like X-ray crystallography. AlphaFold works to put this data in context with highly accurate conformation predictions. With the protein shapes that researchers spent over 10 years trying to predict, AlphaFold is capable of predicting in just minutes. It's able to do this because it was trained on 170,000 known protein structures. Make sure to like, subscribe, and enable the notification bell for the latest news in artificial intelligence, robotics, and brain-computer interface news, and thanks for watching.